Hey guys, welcome back to Minto's Property Show. And today we have brought you all the way to Lavington, Nairobi on this four bedroom villa, which is going for $1.3 million. And I want to give you a detailed tour. If you're interested, get this unit. The number is just here on the screen and at Minto's Properties. So this is our driveway. And uh, you have these two parking lot here and a garage two inside, which can carry up to two cars. So that's a total of four cars. You have another entry for there. I'll show you when you go inside from the garage to the house. But now this is the main entry of the house. You come direct, it take you direct to the swimming pool and the back side of the house so that you can go upstairs. You have these stairs which can take you to the living room upstairs that is but let us go continue with the ground floor first before we go up there so you have this swimming pool here this is the first thing that you'll see when you come uh, to this side and this uh, nicely maintained uh, garden here and uh, the property is already fenced as you can see perimeter wall as a perimeter wall you have your uh, swimming bathroom here this is still the back side of the house but takes you direct this is the entry so when you come here you enter the area you see the swimming pool the garden and uh, come with go to the house What will you do with this space? Uh, just a chilling lawn. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, because uh, the swimming pool is here, the garden is here. I think it will be easy for you to just chill here. And uh, I love one thing about this unit: the tiles that they that they have used, very detailed, and uh, even the sockets of the house. Not in only the inside one, even the outside. You can see it's a universal socket. You can even use a USB here. So it doesn't matter where you're getting your relief from uh, electronics. If it's UK, if it's US, it can still fit. We go inside the house. You're welcome with this massive mahogany door for the main house. Come in. Okay, let me show you something. This is the stairs on your way to the sitting lounge and the bedrooms. But for now, let us concentrate with the First amenity that we a second amenity actually that we have on this uh, villa. You have this fully fitted gym. You can see it's fully fitted. I love the idea that they have used uh, the mats so that if you drop any weights, maybe down. Let me try to get something that I can manage to. <sighs> this one is good. So when you drop it, you can hear the sound. Eh? It doesn't damage the floor. Yeah. So. This gym, if it, this was mine, man, I think I could be a big boy. <laughs> yeah? Let us continue the tour. I told you guys, the ground floor, it's mainly the amenities. Uh, that the swimming pool. You have the gym here. And this door is the one that takes you to the garage. The car garage. And uh, you have this server here, server room. They put the server room that we have uh, down the stairs. And this is your lift. This villa has a lift, that, that's a private lift. This is just to take you up to your uh, top floors. So for today it's off, but we'll continue the tour. We'll just use the stairs, it will be easy. And uh, one thing I love about this, the idea they have used the the, the woods instead of just normal tiles for the stairs and you can see you can feel the way i walk it doesn't have those space you know some units you can go when you're walking to the stairs you feel a sound you get it a freaking sound yeah so which wood is it again mahogany yeah it's a mahogany wood <clears throat> and it has all these sensors light sensors in uh, the stairs so once you're done it will just be off just sense your motion finally guys we are in the first floor of this 
unit and here is the launch sitting launch you have all this satellite tv uh you have i love the sockets that they have on, on this house it's a universal socket we'll show them how it looks like and you have an uh, spot here for usb so you can charge your phone directly from here or if you don't to use anything so this is the sitting lounge of this house. You have a space here. You can't really call this a balcony. That's that sound. This is not really a balcony. Just a, a ventilation, a space for ventilation in the house. As you can see, it's small. But if someone wants to smoke, maybe you can use that uh, outside there. Because we have a very good balcony behind. I'll show you later on the video. So this is a sitting area of the house. And you can see the lift is just dropping you right away here so when you use the lift just bring you direct to the sitting area we have the kitchen here but the access is from this side let's take you now this is the second bathroom for the main house that is we have the other one for the dsq so it's the third one if you count even that one this uh, unit you have this i love the design of this sink I love the idea that they've used a black tap, gives that royalty vibe. And you have a smart mirror here, just press it and it turns on. You have even the dates here and the time. This uh, countertop here is really nice. I love the color, the texture. And you, you can see all the bathroom, but they, they are textured tiles. You can't fall here. You don't have any excuse the same to say that uh, it's not uh, safe for you to take a shower maybe or because it's a wet area obvious. So these are very nice things I've done. And this is the toilet. You can see, I love this idea. This is a wood and it gives that vibe. Very, very nice. It's not just a normal, if you know someone else, so they could have just done a towel and they're, they're good to go. Yeah. So this is really nice. So this is the common, this is the common toilet for this floor because the family room is here. You can put the TV here. This is the family room or the sitting lounge. Depends on how you, you want to use it. And uh, I love this chandelier here. Really looks good. It's a modern one actually. Now I told you that the other space is not a balcony, just a ventilation area. Come and show you the balcony. What it means to have a balcony. Yeah, you can check out all this space. But this grill doesn't come with the house. This is just part of the, the things that you are here just to showcase how you can set up your house. Now this is the balcony I'm talking about. And the balcony, you can go down stairs to the swimming pool using these stairs or outside the house. So if someone doesn't want to use the lift or if they just want to come direct to the house without going inside the, the first ground floor, you can use these stairs. It will be so easy for you guys. Uh, the, swimming, but the swimming pool is just here. So when you're seated here, you can just be checking your kids out what they're doing at the swimming pool. And I really love this idea. You see these trails, the way they are long enough, like even me and the way I'm tall, it's so secure. I think even the kids can't uh, get, uh, they can't jump down. They can't here. fall down. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The kids are even secure here. So let us continue the tour. Come inside. So you have uh, these bookshelves here. And it's quite uh, spacious and I really love it because this space, they have, they have considered those people who really love reading. And uh, this is our dining table. You can see it's very spacious. It's an eight-seater. And I love the idea that they have used uh, this wooden top. Check out the chandelier banner. Eh? It's a very good uh, quality. Hello. Now come and take you to the kitchen. Guys, when I say fully fitted kitchen, this is what I mean. This kitchen is fully fitted. It comes the way it is. So if you buy this unit, you have all this fitted on your kitchen. Maybe if you don't like you don't like something, you can remove, but pretty sure everything is set well the way you like it. And I'll start with the sink here. 
The tap here is movable. You can see the quality of the sink is really good. There's no rusting and all that. The pressure of the water. And remember, this unit has borehole. So that borehole water is the one that you see here. They have processed it. They have a plant for the borehole. And you have this small tap here. This is for drinking water. Or maybe if you want to cook with uh, purified water. You have this purifier here. I'll show them. This is just to purify the water to make it drinkable or consumable. Now, another thing about this kitchen, you have this dishwasher here. And I love the idea they have covered it with this cabinet. It looks just uniform from all the other. It doesn't have a lot of uh, difference and breaking. You have this space here. You can access, you can give someone food if they want food from here. Or you can have, you can just see what's going on now on this kids uh, sitting area there. And you can really close it. And I love the idea that they have used our wooden uh, window instead of glass or all that. These are very good uh, and it's a good quality. Now when you come this side, you have this six burner cooker. Four are gas and uh, two are electric. And one thing I love about this kitchen, check this out. This is a hood. You can pull or push it back when you're done cooking so that you have that uniform uh, layout for the kitchen. You have uh, this organizer for your cutleries, and there are two of them. You have this one here too. And uh, you have this fridge. The kitchen comes with the fridge. That's why I'm telling you these are fully fitted fridge. You love this countertop here. I love the marble. You can see the shiny. Can you check it out? Hope you can get them for you for them. So you have this uh, small bar here for for the kitchen if you want to have a quick breakfast. And another thing I love about this unit, you have this. Can you show them? So when you, you want to maybe prepare something with your blender or coffee maker and all that, if all those sockets are full, you have advantage to use this one. So you can put your coffee maker there and uh, the socket are just here. You can see the good thing about this socket are movable. So you can move it wherever you want and you can remove it if you want. So you turn it, it comes on. When you turn the way it is, that's how you switch it off. And for you to just have an organized kitchen, you have this cover here. You have your microwave and uh, oven here. All this come with the kitchen. I love those cabinets there. The glass cabinet here. Just press it. If you want to open, there's no need for you to get uh, the handle. You just press it and it opens up. So these are one of the things that I really love about this unit. The kitchen, and they have done everything that you may think of. Check out the tile. These are texture -like, texturized tile. So since it's a wet area, obvious kitchen, there's some water. You're safe, you can't fall down. Show them the spotlight there. And uh, you have this speaker on top of uh, the, the sink. And every room here has a speaker, inbuilt speaker that is. And you can play different music from different rooms so if you're in the kitchen and you want to put your own music you can just put on your you can connect with your speaker there let us continue hope you have enjoyed the tour of the kitchen personally I really love the kitchen you have this oil cellar here and another thing let me just show you while i'm here this is a smart home so putting on the light you can just use this or putting off Light. that's a specific areas and you can see the socket are just a very nice quality you can even reduce the light if you don't want it to be so bright you can reduce or add it to be bright so this is a smart home you have that and uh, that's the tour for the first floor first floor there's no uh, bedroom and ground floor too there wasn't any bedroom now hope you're ready we go to the bedrooms now this is the second floor of the unit and remember you can't get tired because you have 
a lift here for this uh, house, for this specific villa. You have these sensors, motion sensors, light on the stairs, and I really love the wood idea that they have used here. So if we were using the, the lifts, this is where it could have, brought, it could have uh, drop us. This is a common area here. So you have this sliding door, we call it bundle door. It's made from a uh, waste product and it's a very good quality. This is the starting area or home office. And I really love oh, the chair here. <laughs> yeah. So you have some nice uh, coffee table here and you can check out it's uh, very high quality. You have another bookshelves here and you have this small balcony, you can call it as you want, but it, it's not really a balcony. This is used for, just for air circulation in the house. The balcony, I've shown you how big it is and we'll go to the next balcony and see it. So come, let's go to the be uh, first bedroom of the house. Now this is our first bedroom and uh, I love one feature about this house. This is, it's all over the house. You have this, come show them. You have this heated towel bar. So this is like a towel warmer. When you switch it on, you go to the bathroom and put your towel on the bar, it gets warm. So that's a very unique uh, feature I've seen on this house. And uh, this is just like, we can call it a, a kit bedroom or guest bedroom. For me, I could use it as a guest bedroom. And uh, you can check out the view that you have here. I love this window. And uh, one thing about this window is the double glasses window. That means you have like two side glass for security, for noise cancellation, so it's a very good uh, quality. You have the alarm sensor here. So if someone's try to break inside the house, the alarm will just uh, notify and it will turn on. The alarm will turn on and security will be here in a minute. You have this net for every unit. This is a foldable. I'll show you the other one. Uh, come to the bathroom with me. So this is uh, bathroom number, bathroom number four. Be sure, this is number three and a half. The one that we saw there down there was uh, two and a half. So this is the third one. This is the heat I was talking about. If you put your tile here and put on the towel warmer, this will just automatically heat your towel. I really love the tiles, the way it's marble and the quality, it's not that shouting, you know? Not, it's a matte finish. Check out the floor. You have another door here that I've told you about. The bundle door. It's a flash door. So it saves a lot of space. You know, if it was just a normal door, this place could feel congested. You have your bath, uh, bath, bathroom here. I love the idea that they use black taps and uh, the shower here is black too. Here is where you can put your towels and all that. Uh, your soap, sorry. This is a sink for this uh, specific room. And it's a smart sink, as you can see. Just press it and it turns on, off, on, off. Uh, check out the sink here. Yeah. Have you seen sink like this before? No, I haven't. This is a very high quality sink. I love the idea. They have tried to play around. It's not uniform sink from the first uh, bathroom that you've seen to this one. So it's a very good idea. And I love the way they have played around with. Even the setup of this, very good. Let us continue to the next bedroom. You see what this. Nice. Now here is the second bedroom of this house and you have this space, an extra space. You can use it as a pantry if you want to. You can uh, use it to put your extra, uh, let's say, duvet or bed sheet here. 
So these are spe extra space for you just to store your your beddings. But you have enough space in the wardrobes here. So guys, <laughs> this is the second bedroom of the house and it's very spacious. You see you have a, a space even to put your sitting uh, seats here just to chill. And uh, one thing I really love about this unit is this ceiling. And when you go to the master bedroom now, you see what I'm talking about. This is a vintage, uh, rusty look. This is a band wood. Check out that uh, paint, man. Give this room character. You, you know, what do you think? What's in your head right now? What do you think this is? It looks like a QR code. A QR code. Yeah. But it, I just noticed it's uh, letters A, B, C, D, and all that. Very nice. Give this room a very good uh, character. So this is a bathroom for this uh, specific room. So this is our fifth bathroom of this uh, unit. Check out the sink. Now, this is different from what you've seen just from the other uh, uh, from the other bedroom. Check out and uh, the taps. The top and the knobs, that they are very classy, man. Take them out. You have your um, overhead shower here. So this, you can call it uh, overhead or lady shower. When you stand here, you can't imagine it's a shower here. Hey, I thought this is a uh, rough finishes, but it's very smooth, eh? Yes. Give that. I call it and it has a mirror inside. You have a very big mirror there. Now, I was telling you about the speakers. You can check out this, the Bluetooth connector. So once you connect your phone with this Bluetooth, you can play your own music here, but we have, uh, you can play the whole house one music too. So let us go to the third bedroom. Come. Uh, this one is almost the same with the uh, one we are, we, are, we are from. Almost the same, but not really the same. So, Almost everything is the same here. You have the speaker, the finishes of uh, the ceiling here. Come and show you something special about this. It has a walk-in closet. Uh, so you have this space here as a walk-in closet. Mind yourself here, you have a mirror, very big mirror. And uh, the bathroom here, this is what I wanted to show you. You see this uh, mirror, it's uh, quite different because it has a, it, once you are, you have, maybe, maybe you're taking a shower and the mirror gets a steam. You just put this on and uh, it will remove the steam itself. And it's another smart one too. So you just put it on, off. I have the towel warmer here, the toilet here. I really love the texture of the tile, wall tile here, especially this one. And uh, the same one here. And the color combination, you can feel that it screams uh, royalty. See the dark, dark, uh, dark, this is a gray or black? It's gray dark. And the print, really love the print here. Just normal, not a simple or a normal uh, plain tile. So the same here, you have this sliding door. Uh, give the house that space. Let us continue. Let us go now to the master bedroom. Hope you're ready. Yeah? You know, we are climbing all this place just to see the master bedroom. And it's the master bedroom only here. Come with me. What's happening to the sensors? I'm turning on. Okay. No, it's behind me. Now, the lift will bring you direct here to the uh, master bedroom too so that's a good thing you have this uh, launch here for the master bedroom if maybe you have a family talk you want to have a family talk you can come here this is a very private place for you and uh, one thing we have a motion sensor in this house and uh, it can alarm you if you want to switch it on if you don't want someone to come maybe in on this floor you can just put on the motion sensor and it will help you like no, someone is going on your bedroom and all that. Let us continue. Let me take you now to the bedroom. Now on the master bedroom, you have this security door. You can see it's a very high quality door. It's hard to break it, very hard. And you can check out all these locks. So once you close it, 
it's so hard for someone to come in. It will take them so, so long for them to be able to break in. And I told you about the, the sensors on the uh, windows. Huh? Yes. So if anything to do with security, security threats, you are sorted here on this uh, villa. Check out this uh, out, outdoor space. You have, you have it here. And uh, finally, we are in the master bedroom. I really love this uh, space here. Check out the high ceiling, the lights. You have the speakers, as I told you about uh, the speakers on the, it's already fitted on all rooms. And uh, check out the bed. I think they just did a good job. They cons this looks like a master bedroom. Or what do you think? Yeah, it's really a master bed. Yeah, it is. You have that extra space there, you'll show them. Uh, you have your uh, opening here. And uh, there are some few things they are rectifying here. So don't mind, guys. Come. So you have this balcony here. This is a private balcony just for the master bedroom. Let me use the back door. <laughs> so this is the walking closet of this uh, master bedroom. You can access from there, from that balcony, or from uh, this side, you'll show them to the, the direction. And uh, this is the way, place that I've been waiting for to come, eh? the master bedroom. When you enter the bathroom, you have toilet here on your right, and it's a uh, private toilet, as you can see, it even has a, uh, they have not just left it on uh, open. Check out this um, masterpiece sink. Eh? Check out the, uh, the the countertop here. Check the quality. Check out the texture. This is one of the best bathroom I've ever been in. You have this here, counter shelves here. You can put your stuff here. That's maybe a watch and all that if you want to. But you have another space there, the walk-in closet. You have this self-steaming mirror too. So if it gets the moisture, it can just clear itself. And it's a smart one, just tap it. Same here, same here. Check out the his and hers sink. You have the two sinks here, and it's a very high quality. Same thing, but they are just the same here. And uh, now, let me even remove my glasses. Guys, we have a sauna here and a steam room on this uh, master bedroom. Let me show you. Sorry. Now, come. Let me show you something. This is the bathroom. And you can see it's a double, uh, double head uh, bathroom. That means you can have a very intimate shower here with you, I suppose. And I really love the tiles on the wall, the tiles on the floor. Check out the pr the prints on the tiles. Just not a normal print, a normal plain tile actually. And now, this is the place I wish I could just uh, go inside. <laughs> you have a bathtub on this master bedroom. Okay? Just imagine and you're not yet done. Show them the the sauna and the steam room. Now this is the steam room. This is the steam room, as you can see. You can put on the steam from all these sides. And you have a sauna here. Show them inside. And it has a speaker there, so you can have your smooth music while you're taking a shower, a, a, a sauna. So I think that's all about this. Uh, four bedroom villa and it's really long. Let's go. Let's go to the master bedroom. I want to do a party shop from there It's really really big and I told you guys about the tiles of this room. This is an engineer uh, Wooden tile. We call it engineer wooden tile because it's not just a tile It's not that normal wooden tile It's mixed wood. They yeah, are very smooth And I love the idea that you can see the sliding doors. They are very uh, strong eh? and you have double glass you have uh, the mosquito net on the door like they have considered almost everything that you can need in the house this is the, this is the 
way to the DSQ. As you can see, you have your laundry area here as you enter so that you are, uh, the people that are working for you here can just access it and uh, wash your cloth, clean your cloth and all that. This unit comes with two DSQ. This is the first one. And you can check out the sockets here. Still universal, same quality, and the tiles here are really nice. Come and take it the next one. When you come this way, you have your community kitchen here for the servants, and you have your toilet here, which is common. They use both of them. Come show them the, the interior of the toilet. This is the DSQ washroom. As you can see, it's just perfect. And here is the second DSQ. But for today, we won't be able to show you inside, but just the duplicate with the, the one that we've shown you the first one. It has some uh, stuff inside, construction uh, material. And uh, finally, we are done. I'm just seated here on the uh, master bedroom launch. I want to give you the final details about this unit. It has a um, fully backup generator for the house. Since we have a lift inside your villa, so you have to get a fully backup generator. We have solar for heating the water. So all the hot water in this house is sorted with solar. That means bills are quite sorted for here. electricity and it's located mm -hmm. on a gated community. So you're safe about uh, high rise building and all that. If you're really interested to get this unit, just contact the number on the screen. Make sure you engage on our video. Give us a like if you really like it. At Mintel's property, the home is where your story begins. Thank you.